previously on Murphy's Diesel. Boy, they got all the good out of this one, huh, folks? Did y'all see that tree run into? How about that, huh? Welcome back to Murphy's Diesel, folks. We told you we had another rollover, and here we are. It was like 60 miles down the road, so it's 9.30. And we're going to drag this whole pile of Kenworth out of here, and all the axles are ripped out of it. He really did a number on her, huh, folks? Poor old Kenworth. But anyway, we're gonna drag her out of here, throw her on the low boy, you know, that new triple axle, slide axle. We're supposed to be leaving, like in eight hours, to go pick up the new mat tracks, but here I am, you know, showing you guys a recovery. You're welcome. That's a big old tree. <laughs> you want to get that skid steer, Michael? Yeah, where's the skid? It's right there. It just pulled up. Grab this tree and drag it out. How about that tree, huh, folks? Looks like a job for the skid steer. <laughs> Driver walked away without a scratch, folks. We're gonna, we're actually gonna work this in the AM, but there's so many people driving by calling in and telling them that, hey, there's a wreck truck over there, somebody's a so. And they're, even though we got caution tape, cones, signs, you know, they just, you know, they just catch a glimpse when they're coming 75, 80 mile an hour down the highway and you just see a tractor trailer laying on its side out of your peripheral. You're like, holy you see that? There's a tractor trailer laying on its side. And they call into 911. Oh, there's bodies everywhere and, yeah. What do you need? What can I do for you? You got it, Trey? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You ready for a chain? Yeah. Can you handle the chain? Yeah. You gotta go around the cab, Trey. Around the cab, Trey. Around the cab, Trey. I can't get it on my cab. Huh? Hey, what if I, what if I get you, uh, hold on, hey, get out of there for a second. I can feed you uh, a round sling. We'll pick this up and we'll run a round sling underneath it. They get frozen. Yeah. 
Oh, that Bailey's gear. Nothing but the good stuff, huh? Old boater's gonna get her backed in here. So, we could just pick it. What is it? All right, so we're about got this rigged up. We're just gonna pick the tractor up, set it on the slide axle, got all the trees out, so. Stand by, folks. I, Craig, I pushed that under to you so you didn't have to do that. I'm moving the truck. Hi, you want to hook it to the long rope? What? You want to hook it to the long rope that you did? Yeah. Hey, dug it out for nothing. That is fine now. Let me pull my other rope out. <laughs> yeah, awesome. I'm glad we're always on the same page. Thanks, Jake. You're welcome. Yeah. First time I've seen it that high. <coughs> that was badass. It's the pole. No, it's not. It's not pulled all the way. You gotta pull it and shift it forward, Trey. Yeah. Kenworth, pull it and shift it forward. Heavy pull it. There you go. Good? Yeah. Okay, it's locked in. Huh? It's locked in. Yeah. You got it? Yeah. I think so. I mean, it's pulled, but it's not. It's dying all over. Here. Jeez. Watch your truck, Finner. stand under it and change the oil. <laughs> <laughs> I've had my truck like that plenty of times, but I've known it. <laughs> it's unhooked, Fitter. You pull it out, son. <laughs> <laughs> 
Let me have Brad too. Or is it holding up? Brad's holding up. Brad's holding the cab. Let it go. See if it does anything. Good. Look, Craig. Pretty much one. Everyone's gonna double right up, isn't it? He's gonna hook it. He's gonna hook the eyes up. Okay, I'm gonna do that right there. Yeah, yeah. You even lift it up? Alright, Peter. Back under, buddy.
grab that skid steer and come over here and push this. Easy trick! What's in it? Carriage. Carriage. 36,000 pounds of carriage. How much? 36,000 pounds of carriage. I am hungry. So, so, in the, so the way we rig this up, like, and it is easier. I think it's about the same. Jack to an area. Probably if I like it though, because it can save someone. 6-1, half dozen another right? railroad. Right? What do you think, Michael? Uh, it's looking pretty good. Got it picked out. Belly's holding. Belly of the trailer is holding up. So. Don't think we're gonna blow out. We're just getting some straps under there. You want absolutely none of these, buddy. I'll take all of them. The side of fries. These are registered weapons. <laughs> Anybody want to volunteer to help thinner out? What's up? Anybody want to volunteer to help thinner out? I think he's gonna start hooking up his side over there. Two web shackles on there. Yeah. Can't put two web shackles on there. Yeah, I got it. Take the web shackle off this one. Take and put a soft shackle to these and to that. Think you handle that? Yeah. All right, climb up there. Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? All right, hey, so everybody's on the same page. We're picking, rolling. So we're going to pick this side and stand up. Pick both sides up, booms up, and then roll and let out. Good? You guys good? See how his, when his swings that way, it's because you're not tight enough. Boom up, Finner.
hot cup of recovery, buddy. <laughs> I just want to get home and get out of here. Everything go as planned? Uh, yeah. It's on its wheels. It's on its wheels. Carrots are still inside. How about you, Olsen? How was recovery number two? Fun, different. We're ready Look. for recovery number three? Do we have another one right now? Not yet. Wow. <laughs> Sunday's coming up. Yeah, you never know. How'd it go, Fenner? Went pretty good. Everything is planned? No, uh, it's a little heavy in those mic truck, but it went all good. Yep. Carrots are still in there. Yeah, it's still here. They're on the wheels. Yeah. This is heavy, you know. How'd it go? Uh, went real well. Rolled her over. Uh, struggled a little bit. We had the 50 ton in the front and got a little heavy. Need to go back to the yard and do some more training, folks. You know, should have been training this whole lull that we had. You know, you always. We're always rusty when we come back on, so. Hey, where are my six by it's six on its box wheels. Box. It ain't broken half. Fully loaded. So, 40,000 pounds. Carrots. So, uh, everybody did a pretty good job. It's late. What time is it? About 1 a.m. That's it? Hey, you really? made this up. I guess we did a pretty good job. <laughs> I, know, I thought it was like five in the morning. <laughs> oh, it is only one. Uh, yeah, the truck, I mean, we fought the truck more than anything, so. For as bad as that truck is, I mean, I would say we did a pretty good job. I mean, for the time, I mean, we're done. We're gonna pick this trailer up and back the tractor under it right now and we're out of here, so we're all wrapped up. Tricks. Yeah. Heavy T is about to die. Just being dramatic. Yeah. <laughs> Just being dramatic. Diabetes is a choice. Why do you choose to have it? No. Diabetes is a choice. There's that man pulling in his truck and fucking got his truck. That's fine. I'm driving down the road. Cold. That's right, son. You're cold. It's cold. I'm trying to protect him from the elements. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't going home early. Here. So quit the act. <laughs> so how'd it go, Trey? Heavy tea? Right. Ain't feeling it, huh? Yeah, I guess so. They have a pizza party or something to boost morale. Yeah. Ridiculous. <laughs> they act like they just did two rollovers in one day. Yeah. Two rollovers almost 100, 100 miles apart, too. Everybody wants to work until it's time to work. Don't touch me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what? All right. What's that you had earlier? I gave it to Craig. Well, where's it at, Tegan? Heavy oh, yeah, tea. I gave it to you. The one I had when you guys the last rep? Thing. No, the one you just had. Oh, that, I didn't have a headset. Remember, you took my headset. I didn't have a headset the whole time. Where's my headset? Did you guys lose my headset? <laughs> It's not like you ever charge them anyway. Well, like I've been just charged it. So is the other one's charge. I found the charger. It's not like they're doing good. Yeah. Uh, if Michael blames you one time, I'm going to Hear that, Michael? <laughs> no f***ing playing. <laughs> Leave that in, Cody.
fifth wheel drag. Yeah, I'm going to Montana, so you guys are on your own for a couple days. You're going to Montana? Yeah. yeah we'll what? be back Monday, when? Track. Oh, you're going to pick them up from that guy down there, too? Two. That guy down there, too. That's where the other guy got it from, uh, Casey. Casey Liddell? Yeah. Are you watching? But you don't watch no. out. No. No. I, I said no. I've never no, seen I don't, it. I don't. I don't. <laughs> Casey's the red. He said that with authority to know. Casey who? Yeah, I, 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 he probably knows uh, Chuck and them. Like, I, I read about it on somebody's track. Track. Uh, track. That used to be Chuck. Uh, uh, I need something to fall asleep to. Oh, oh, so that's why you watch this channel? <laughs> no. Or... no, I watch it. Yeah. I watch it all the time. I watch it yeah. until he Dude. said, uh, what, Casey, you fucking Casey right was the one that, that, said, oh, that told me about it. Turn it off. <laughs> Don't tip that truck over, Peter, while I'm gone. I will. You got to get truck tracks or you get in uh, bad other tracks. Bad tracks? Yeah. They are awesome. Yeah, they're Full a lot better than those. Yeah. Well, that's a wrap, folks. Nailed her like a split hog. I mean, scratch a corner on this bad Larry. We came, we saw, we recovered. And it is colder than a well digger's asshole out here tonight, folks. So you stay classy, you dirty old totals out Kenworth that we forgot to disconnect the batteries that had a tree hanging out of the side of it. It's out of here. Carrot Hall and Kenworth. Get out of here, boys!